hi welcome back to my channel thank y'all very very much for clicking on so i'm gonna be i'm um, doing just like a little read or whatever i'm gonna just get some messages out for whoever needs to hear it it's gonna be for all zodiac signs the collective and i wanted to say too um so i did change the name of my channel i ain't feel like i had to mention it but because you know i guess it is somewhat of a community i am saying that <laughs> but i'm going to be posting like different type of content i'm not going to be um posting a lot of readings y'all because i feel like i want to get um away from using the cards or whatever but i wanted to mention too since i'm going to be starting back um posting consistently i been noticing right and i'm a i'm a state and i hate to sound like this y'all but i mean it is what it is and i'm just saying it's like very respectfully humbly but this is my platform and i do care about it and i put in a lot of work okay especially with having to upload these videos y'all it that'd be like the hardest part okay waiting for a video to upload especially if you ain't got a fast wi-fi but um i spent a lot of time like doing youtube or whatever and i'm gonna i'm gonna have to stay on some of y'all next okay the ones who like to watch and i was just looking at my analytics too i was like let me let me just check before i say something about it but it's been going on for a while and i'm talking about um it's going on three years now because i started my channel march exactly march 17th um 2019 and of course i did not reach 3,000 subscribers overnight but it been stuck at 3,000 for like a minute and it's going down too so it's like it's almost like every time I post I be losing subscribers but it's cool it's fine um it be mostly uh females anyway I guess it'd be some men but it's mostly females and it's crazy because the number of it was y'all the number of it like the um females that um watch my videos they are subscribed y'all subscribe right is 88.8 percent .8%. and i was like wow my channel is abundant okay and i feel it is abundant i be seeing signs all the time like even like with the numbers like on my channel i know my channel is abundant and um divinely guided as well and i'm super confident saying that but i'm gonna have to stay on y'all next about engaging it's like you sitting here watching a person like looking at them in their face okay and it's like you never engage for like a whole year two years possibly three because i don't know how long people been on here because i know i do have like new subscribers somewhat but lately i just been like like you know people just been falling off they've been dropping off and that's cool that's fine but i'm talking about the ones that are subscribed you watch consistently every time i upload so i'm gonna have to stay on on y'all next to where y'all just gonna get tired and you just gonna leave so yeah, i had said that before but now i'm serious this time i'm gonna be on y'all next every video i'm gonna say something about it and i may make some other content too because that right there is like really getting on my nerves i do not like that type of stuff it's like people that be in your energy they like to watch your social medias they like to look at you be in your face and stuff know what you got going on but they don't say a word they don't even you know support or nothing and i find it quite funny too because it's like most of these people be having their own stuff going on but it's like they want somebody to support them and even like with these readings too it's like it be the same ones that don't be showing love but you watching love reads it's like make it make sense to me that does not make any type of sense it's like how you trying to see you know if you got some new love coming in but you ain't even showing love to something that you've been putting your you know that you've been um giving your energy to or like something that you um are using your time surrounding or whatever because you sitting here watching or you watching these um reads or whatever but it's like you're not giving nothing in return it's just like nothing literally for like two three years that's how i don't be understanding how people be like <laughs> y'all excuse me i just don't understand understand how people be in relationships but it's like it shows what your like social group or like what you engage in it's like you can't even show love in the simplest form by like you know liking a person's video that you've been watching you listening to what they saying okay you probably taking the insight in taking the advice or whatever i don't know what they be doing but it don't make sense to me but it says a lot though so i'm gonna get into this read y'all i'm gonna start ranting but now i had to say that it just needed to be said because ain't nobody else gonna say it okay what does the collective need to know what message can i give to all signs what are they needing to know
there could be some type of offer that comes in y'all this could be a job opportunity a promotion um this could even too come in as some type of help or assistance um water sign energy could be very significant too even though i do have a cancer channel i know most of y'all like some of y'all are on here because i did start this channel first and i was on cancer reads i may have to start doing some cancer reads on here to get some motion okay because right now it's just like very stagnant i don't like stagnant type of energy um because i'm one to be changing stuff up like you know a lot but because i don't like to see stuff the same okay um even with myself too but you could be a water sign energy cancer pisces scorpio it looks like for some people you can have a king of swords in your energy they don't have to be an air sign aquarius gemini libra energy we got a knight of pentacles earth sign energy capricorn taurus virgo let's see what else comes out here what else are they needing to see here What message can I get to all signs? What message can I get to all signs? There's some, um, for some people, there's some type of proposal. Like for some people, you could be getting engaged. Because the three of cups came out. For some people, you could be connected to somebody. This could be in some type of like social group, a community with this three of cups. Because I feel like it. Um, this could be somebody that you are socially acquainted with. So it could be like an acquaintance, but there's somebody in your energy um, that could be wanting to give you some type of help or assistance. Let me see what else comes out. What else are they needing to hear right now? So we got a death card showing up here. So with the death card showing up here, um, it looks like what card was that at the bottom i can't even remember what that was but um and i'm gonna be switching my reads up too i'm not gonna be um using that many cards y'all i'm gonna just keep it simple um not really plain jane or whatever but i do feel like um most of these these like viewers are the people that be watching it's like either they do reads too and they just trying to check in with the energy that is like very silly to me it's like it's cool to do every once in a while but it's like you just if that's like what you doing and it's like you're not even leaving nothing in return then that's just crazy it's like okay because to me that's a red flag it's like mostly um women that watch um my videos they're subscribed but it's like the engagement is so low it's like what is going on so it's like either you doing reads too or i don't know trying to see if the messages align i don't know and i just feel like if you are connected then you shouldn't have to do that i can see every once in a while but all the time consistently something ain't right but um let me see what else comes out what else are they needing to hear right now Okay, so we got an emperor. Okay, y'all. So look, we got the emperor and the emperor showing up here. So divine masculine, divine feminine energy is showing up. So yeah, for some people, you could be reuniting with your, like you could be coming together with your divine masculine, divine feminine. And I'm talking about the real ones, not these toxic ones, the ones that you think that is it, but they not, they like super toxic and they don't even want you. Not that energy. I'm talking about the real ones. The real divine masculine, divine feminine, um, divine masculine, divine feminine um, energies. The real emperors, the real empresses. You and this person could already have like a business or because there's already money. There's abundance that's here. It's like two people that's abundant, right? It's like one person is, one person is not um, manipulating the other person or you trying to use the other person for their abundance or their money. So like material possessions could be very significant too. It's like the emperor got his own, the empress got her own too. But it's like they could be coming together. There could be some type of plan too. So it could be like a business plan or something of that sort. 
um, that's happening here. So let me see what else comes out. What else are they needing to see here right now? Yeah, there's an offer that's coming in. Temperance showing up here too. This could be someone's soulmate. Soulmate energy is here. There's divine protection as well, y'all. Now, I feel like this could be for the people. Like, if you truly do resonate with divine feminine, divine masculine um, energies, it's like you're not just calling yourself an empress, but you're not. It's giving like baddies, east or west, whatever that stuff called. But um, with the four of cups showing up here, for some people, you're like super bored or it's like you are completely over it. This could be when it comes to like dating or just life in general. And... Uh, <laughs> I was about to talk about something like earlier today, but I was like, nah, let me not do that. I'm gonna just keep it, you know, straight to the point or whatever. But I was saying like, and not really sure if anybody else feel, feels this way, but it's like, it feels like I want to like get out of, but it's like, I don't know what I want to get out of. It's like, we are in a simulation basically. And it's like, I want out, but it's like, where I'm gonna go. <laughs> it's like, where I'm gonna go. So it's like, you ain't got no choice, but to see. <laughs> Look, you ain't got no choice but to sit here, unfortunately. So it's like, if you feeling that way, y'all, just know that, you know, divine forces see what's going on. So there's going to be some type of offer that comes in, especially if you feel stagnant or stuck. Because that energy been going out around for a long time. But, you know, if you think about it, too, it's like, there's if you think about it, y'all, it's not really like a lot of people that are in their, like, true divine masculine, divine feminine energy. Like, even though we have both but it's, you know, most people are not really focused on healing. They got other stuff going on or it's like they're choosing not to do so. If you think about it, but it's like you're tired of it. It's like you want to get out of this simulation like fast in a hurry. But it's like, where are you going to go? Okay. Can't get on a spaceship and go to Mars. I mean, you probably could, but, you know, we can't. We don't have the resources to do so. But um, I see divine protection around you, too. So it's like, even though you could be kind of like bored, it's like you just completely over this whole thing, like being on Earth. It's like Earth is ghetto, right? Um, you could be tired of the people, too, y'all. Lately, I've been feeling that way, too. It's just like a lot of fake stuff going on. And it's like when you say something, don't nobody don't nobody want to, like, you know, um, take accountability for it. So it's like you just choose not to say something. And to me, that's like super uncomfortable. Um, cause I'm going to say something eventually, whether you want to believe it or not. So I'm going to see what else comes out here. What else are they need to hear? So look, five of wands energy showing up here, y'all. A lot of like conflict and drama, but it's super petty. It's just like people trying to come up against you. It's a lot going on energetically. See, it's that low vibrational type of energy that's going on. And for some reason, y'all, and this was kind of showing up in a previous read where I was talking about it's basically given a haunting. Like, it's the type of, it's like people who are not really spiritually aware. It's like you don't really know that much about energy or you just don't care. I don't know. Um, but some people feel entitled, entitled to other people's energy. Especially when they're low vibrational, but it's like, no, you don't want to engage in this type of energy, especially if it's like super competitive too. That's what it looks like. But it looks like y'all could be fighting past energies too, like past people. I don't know what that is. Cause it look like a whole bunch of kids, something about like kids fighting or um, people with like childish behavior. It's like they grown, but they act childish. It's like they'll, they'll rather choose to fight and fix the problem or like to work on themselves to be to become a better version of themselves. And this actually takes more energy than just actually, you know, um, trying to sit there and fight the person. But let me see, especially when a person just wants peace. So for some people, you could be like needing to protect your peace at this time. Give me some more insight here for the collective. What else are they needing to hear? Thank you. Yeah, so this Six of Cups keeps showing up here, y'all. 
for some people you could be receiving a visit from somebody like somebody could be wanting to visit you this could be somebody that you ain't seen in a while but i do see where for some people it's like you know certain past energies especially if it's like conflict or drama attached to it it's like of course you don't want to reunite with these people so it's like you know of course use your discernment but it looks like you're for the most part it's like you're protecting your peace and there could be um people could be kind of unsure on whether or not you want to like engage with them or even like meet up with them because they are technically like a past person and it's like they could already know that you are spiritually aware of that type of stuff too you know how like it's certain people actually like right now that don't know nothing about like mercury retrograde or, and stuff like that it's like you know past people trying to come back but it's like actually a test or, like some of these um unexpected reconciliations it's like the people that want to come back to you after they done did you wrong. Okay, they done betrayed you, but they want to get back with you. It's like, what? Give me some more insight here. What else are they need to see here? What else are they need to see here right now? Okay, so we got the chariot showing up here. The ace of pentacles coming out too. It looks like you guys are moving forward towards something stable. It's like you're receiving this. Now, this could be like financial stability. Either way, it's abundance that's coming towards you. It's being given to you or granted to you. See, it's like the divine be seeing everything. Whatever you believe in, higher source, higher power. Um, they be seeing everything, y'all. Okay. Something's coming to an end. It's like something's coming to an end, but then there's a new beginning that's in store or that's like available. It's like being a new beginning is being granted to you or being given to you, right? So of course, you know, you can pick and choose. It's like, it's your choice. Okay, but just make sure you're using your discernment, like using um discernment, using your intuition when it comes towards these like choices or options that's available to you. So for some people, you could have a lot of options and choices. But it's like you're choosing wisely because you're aware, you're spiritually aware of the deception that's in between like these op options and choices. So yeah, let me see what else comes out. Actually, you know what? No, I'm done. I'm done talking for the day, y'all. I got to go. But thank you very much for watching.